Welcome to my first vegetable garden. Today I want to give you two examples of how you can protect your cool weather plants from the frost. And I'm going to use peas as, as an example. I got these out last week when we were having unseasonably high temperatures and you know I was in the spirit, got the peas out. But right after putting them out, about a week later we got a night of 17 degrees, a night of 20 degrees, a night of 25 degrees. Peas your cool weather vegetables can take a light frost, a freeze, and even get down to like 28 degrees. But you can see how the stems are now brown. These plants didn't recover. And it was just too cold. It's fine, you know, if you get a light frost. Let me work your way over to some more peas here, and then I'm going to show you how you protect them from the frost. It's fine if you get a light frost. Again, these are dead. They're not going to recover. I've started more indoors, and you can just see how beat up they are. Over here is another variety. It did a little bit better. But again, the stems are white. Some green stems on that one. Some of those will probably survive, but they're so beat up, they're best just to replace them to let the peas struggle. Well, here's how you protect them. I also planted the peas in containers. And you can protect your cool weather crops with hard rigid plastic cups. The reasons you want the hard cups is because you can press them into the soil and the wind's not going to blow them away. But let me show you the peas. So over here I got the bigger plastic cups and this is what they look like when they're protected with cups. A little bit beat up but the major stem parts are nice and green and these guys will recover and do perfectly fine. But these rigid cups create a nice little microclimate and it will really protect your plants. And I'm surprised that these made it because it, it really got down to 17 degrees and 20 degrees, just crazy temperatures around here. But they survived. The next thing you can do is you can also put the cups down and then create this little teepee where you just pull the bag up and you tie it shut and it creates, you know, a microclimate within a microclimate and same peas that I showed you in the beginning out in the ground are all dead and they're not going to recover. But by just setting this up real quick, these peas survived, a little curled. You definitely want to get them out from under these cups now that it's warmer because if it's 50 degrees, you got this on, you're actually going to go to the other end. Instead of the cold damaging them, the, the sun when it's 50, 55, 60 degrees, really will heat up the inside of the cup and then heat will end up damaging the plants. But this is a way that you can provide frost protection for your lettuces, for your greens, for your peas. Just get these rigid hard cups, cover over your transplants or your little um, lettuce plants, spinach plants, uh, broccoli, cauliflower, what else we have? Peas, anything that's a cool weather crop that can take a light freeze. You can give them a couple degrees of protection with these plastic cups and even more by putting a bag up over them in this TP style. Hope this video gives you some idea of how you can protect your crops if you get a really cold freeze coming through your, your area. Please check out my blog at www.therustedgarden.blogspot.com and also check out my YouTube videos. Thanks.